Hello, and welcome to the video on the HowToNetwork.com Hot IT Certifications to Look Out For for 2021. So without further ado, let's jump in. Number one certification, the Cisco CCNA. The CCNA has been the gold standard of IT certifications for around 20 years now, and nothing's changed for 2021. The CCNA lays a solid foundation for so many IT subjects, including IP, wireless and wireless security, virtualization, IPv6, routing and switching, network security, network automation, and programmability, which we'll be looking at in more detail later on in this video. So please put this Cisco CCNA at the top of your list of certifications for 2021. Number two, the Linux LPIC. 85% of organizations run Linux, so it's really important that you understand how to use it and how it works. At the moment, there's a huge shortage of qualified Linux engineers, which is good news when you're looking for a job. The Linux Professional Institute, or LPI, is the number one Linux certification vendor and they offer certifications from beginners up to expert levels. If you're a beginner, consider the LPI Linux Essentials exam. Linux is free to use, so you can download it onto your desktop or run it in a virtual machine and get lots of hands-on experience at no cost. You can currently take all of the exams online. If you're looking for DevOps or security as a career choice, then Linux is a must-have skill. Number three, the CompTIA Security Plus. CompTIA offer foundation-level exams for many IT areas, including security. The CompTIA Security Plus is a door-opener certification for many IT careers, from technical to security management. They're a must-have for any government role or any contract. The CompTIA security exam covers all of the latest industry trends and techniques, and the syllabus is regularly updated by CompTIA. Number four, another CompTIA exam, the Penetration Test Plus. Here you'll learn how to close network vulnerabilities for your own or your customer's network. You can close down wireless security holes you can test your network resiliency. You're tested on a mixture of hands-on and management skills, so you need to be able to prepare penetration documentation. The Penetration Plus skills easily transfer into a consulting role. Number five, the Certified Ethical Hacker. Here you'll learn the latest hacking tools. You can secure your wireless networks, cloud networks, and also your local area network. You'll learn how to reverse engineer malware attacks. It's a highly practical exam. The CEH is the perfect complement to the Penetration Test Plus and the Security Plus exams that we previously discussed. Number six, the Cisco CyberOps Associate. This is a new exam and only one of three associate level exams that Cisco now offer. Here you'll learn security monitoring and policies. You can lock down Windows and Linux machines. You'll do a deep dive into network packets and network traffic. You'll learn to write security policies and procedures for your company. Number seven, the Cisco DevNet Associate. So in this countdown, we're covering all three associate level exams from Cisco. Network automation is the future of IT networking. It moves configuration tasks from humans to software. The DevNet syllabus includes APIs, Python scripting, and networking. You'll learn JSON, application development, automation tools, and much more. Learning DevNet topics is essential if you want to future-proof your career. 
Number 8. The Microsoft MTA Python Microsoft offer many MTA-level exams, from databases to operating systems, servers, and more. We're looking at the Python Introduction to Programming MTA Qualification. Python's easy to learn, simple to use, and it's free to download and use on your local machine. It's used for web and software development and system scripting, and it's essential to know if you want to learn about DevOps. Number 9. The CompTIA Project Plus. So yet another CompTIA certification. In this certification, you'll learn to manage small to medium-sized projects. You'll manage the project from start to completion. You can become a technical project manager if you have the skills to complement. Here you'll learn to interface with managers and vendors. You'll manage the stakeholders, the budget, suppliers, documentation, and communication. And finally, number 10, the Azure slash CompTIA Cloud Essentials. We've put these both together because the syllabus is almost identical. So if you study for one exam, you can definitely take the other exam with just a little bit of extra work. Azure is used by 95% of Fortune 500 companies. It runs over 200 products and cloud services. You can learn Azure with free trials. The AZ900 exam is perfect for foundation level knowledge and non-technical roles. Here you'll learn Cloud Basics and Microsoft Azure offerings. Okay, so that's our full list of 10. I'm sure there's something we missed, so if you come up with a new idea or have a comment, please drop a comment below. If you're interested in learning any of the certifications we mentioned, please come over to howtonetwork.com, where for a dollar, you get 30 days access to all those certification courses and many more. If you want to get this special deal, go to howtonetwork.com forward slash YouTube. Here you can access over 25 or more courses on IT skills, career training, interview skills, and study skills. There's unlimited practice exams. Live Cisco racks are available 24 seven. There's expert support on the forum. We offer career training, and we also offer exam strategy training and support. Thanks for listening.